go live now to 7 Action News reporter Tara Edwards, who's been talking to a nurse who once came to Dr. Fada for an interview. Okay, Tara, what do you have for us tonight? Well, this oncology nurse is still very emotional and upset about this. She says that she went in for an interview and was disgusted by what she found inside. Angela Swantek is an oncology nurse. So upset, she came forward to 7 Action News about her experience with Dr. Fada. She was up for a position, she says, in his office three years ago. Swantek decided to go to the office to see if she would like to work there. But what happened in a matter of an hour and a half left her sick to her stomach. According to Swantek, she couldn't believe how patients were being treated there and said there was also gross neglect. Chemotherapy being infused at inappropriate times. So something that should go over 15 minutes, he, he ordered to be done in an hour or two. Things just being infused incorrectly. So as a nurse, I went home and I went online and I printed out the form and I turned him into the state medical board. She complained to the state medical board, but she got a letter later saying there was no wrongdoing found and quote, the public health code could not be established to support disciplinary proceedings. Swantech wonders what more she could have done. Very upsetting as an oncology nurse and the, all the patients that I've taken care of in the 23 years. And I was angry because I felt what else could I have done? You know, I turned him into the medical board. And Swantek says that she ended up taking a job at another doctor's office near Dr. Fada, and she says it was very hard for her to go to work every day. We will be following this closely and bring you any new information when we get it. Reporting live in downtown Detroit, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.